Hi, I'm Andrew Gillis, Vice President of Research and Development with Sepro Mineral Systems. I'm here at our head office, just outside of Vancouver, Canada, where we conduct most of our R&D activity. And I'm gonna give you a quick tour and overview of some of the R&D projects that we have ongoing right now. First up is our microwave project. Here's the pilot microwave unit right behind me. This is a project we're doing in collaboration with a number of different people. The idea is to expose rocks to high energy microwaves for a short period of time uh, to create micro fractures in the ore and to create a thermal signature that we can use for sorting. If you're interested in hearing more about this specific project, you can check out a video we have given a project overview. Just search Can Micro on Sepro's YouTube channel and the video will pop right up. Okay, up next we've got a novel milling technology we've been working on. Uh, unfortunately, I have to keep a bit under wraps, intellectual property and patent protection to come out of it. Um, but what I can tell you is we did some bench scale test work on this sort of device arrangement. Uh, we achieved around 50% reduction in energy required compared to a ball mill. We have just built this prototype and we're gonna start testing soon. Uh, if those results uh, hold up at the pilot stage, then we'll end up having a technology that should be able to grind in the same way as a ball mill would, but achieve a 50% savings in energy. So we're really excited about this one. Okay, next up is an innovation from Sepro's mixing and pumping division. Uh, this is a peristaltic pump hose. Improvements to this hose, as well as some of the other pump components, are aimed at dramatically increasing the pressure that the Sepro peristaltic pump is able to generate. Something like a positive displacement pump is typically able to generate very high pressures, um, but at the same time, it's extremely costly. So we're hoping that uh, if all this works out, we'll be able to have a peristaltic pump that generates pressures similar to positive displacement pumps, but at a small fraction of the cost. Gravity concentrators are obviously something that's very important to Sepro. Uh, the Falcon concentrator runs deep in our history. It's still extremely important to us and we've been doing a lot of innovation around the concentrator recently. One of those projects has been examining bowl profiles and seeing if there's something we can do to improve recovery by changing bowl profiles. You see here we have uh, number one, number two, and number four. Uh, actually, number three is our most successful. It's out doing plant trials right now, and we'll be releasing a lot more information on that. Um, we've seen some really impressive recovery improvements and. Uh, we're really excited to get more information out there, um, but we're making sure we're taking uh, methodical steps uh, before we do that. But stay tuned, there should be a lot more information about that soon. All right, and rounding out the tour today, I can't show you, but I can tell you about. Under this sheet is some test equipment for a project we have to try to remove the need for water in batch gravity concentrators. So people familiar with uh, you know, the Falcon or the Nelson concentrator used for gold recovery, know that it requires quite a bit of fresh water to operate. And we've had a project going on for a while now to try to eliminate the need for additional water in these batch concentrators. We had some very good results using a particular mechanism for concentration that didn't require water. And right now we're working on mechanically scaling that up to our industrial units. So I hope you've enjoyed the little tour today. If you want to stay up to date with the things that are going on with Sepro uh, from an R&D point of view or otherwise, check back with seprosystems.com. Look at our blog posts on our website, our posts on LinkedIn, are a great way to find out more information. You can also subscribe to our newsletter uh, so you can receive regular updates on the things that we're up to. Thanks very much for watching.